Hi you? everyone, Chris Morris here. Um, I've got the very, very, very big pleasure of having a quick fire session with our captain Sanju Samson today. So I'll start us off. <laughs> Sanju? Yes, first Mori. Of all, welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, what is the best piece of advice you've ever been given and who gave it? Best piece of advice uh, ever given to me was to smack every ball I face. So that was given by Chris Morris when I met him at 2016, 14 and 15. So far so good. Yeah, it feels good. Beautiful. Yeah. It's a good piece of advice, I think. Good See one. ball, hit ball. See ball, hit ball. <laughs> <laughs> yes. My turn. No, it's my turn. I know, my turn. I want to answer. Oh, my turn to question. <laughs> Who is your favourite cricketer in IPL apart from me? Sanju is my favourite, number one, of course, obviously, because look at him. And I've known him for a long time and I've watched him develop into the man he is today mm. and player. But I really enjoy watching Hardik play. Oh, Hardik, okay. Yeah, I think he's yeah, he showstopper. Is. I mean, he just, he's prime time. It's a proper answer. We all love him, actually. Yeah. Only when he plays for India, actually. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> What does your mom have to say about your videos on RR's social media? She doesn't like it when I say bad words on TV. <laughs> and the RR guys are selling me down the river. So, no, she finds it funny. She, she, she finds it very entertaining when I'm, when I'm being myself. So, okay. yeah. You guys stop catching me saying bad words. My mom's going to cross <laughs> me again. Guys, please. Please. Okay. Please, guys. What is the most difficult thing you've had to do as captain so far? The most difficult thing is to just talk in each and every meeting. <laughs> as I say, doing that, each and every meeting, everyone expects me to give a long speech. So, I might be getting good at it, but I feel I actually hate it. Don't change. It's the best, <laughs> best speeches ever. They either consist of a thumbs up or it's a five minute speech. Don't ever change. Yeah. Stay the same, that's what players want, keep it simple. Absolutely. If you could trade lives with uh, anyone for a day, who would it be and why? I would probably trade lives with Neil Armstrong, I think so, so I could feel what it feels like to be on the moon. Uh, we feel you always walk on the moon the way you walk. <laughs> walking on the moon. Exactly. When was the last time you were late for something? The last match I played, I was late. Played that shot, I think. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, late, late on the shot. <laughs> late on the shot, actually. <laughs> that's, that's, yeah. that's a good answer, I like that. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> if you could have one sub superpower, what would it be? But it is to be invisible. Invisible? Yes, wow. to, to turn my invisibility on and off. Wow. <laughs> Oh, cheapers. I'd mess with the umpires, I'd mess with the team, I'd mess with the opposition. I'd mess with the people in the hotel, because there's always rumours of a haunted hotel. Imagine I'm invisible. Oh, my days. I'd have so much fun. Who's your best mate at the Rajasthan Royals, apart from me? Apart from Chachu, I'd like to say... Kumar Sangakara is my <laughs> new best friend, actually. <laughs> Absolutely, I get along really nice with Kumar actually. The next question, I think we have 100 questions more to go. What's your favourite word? Brew. Brew. I use brew that's, for everything. That's How's a brother? Brew? Yeah, it's basically brother in South Africa. Brew. Uh, that and how's it? Hello. Hogya, <laughs> hogya. Nice. Beria, beria. Very good, very good. Very good. <laughs> uh, very nice. what's, what's the dish you cook best? I cook the best. Yes. Nothing, maybe an omelette. You can cook an omelette? Yeah. What do you put in your omelette? Masala omelette? Nothing. Only the egg and just fry it up actually. <laughs> I mean, that is also a talent. It's also a talent. I mean, you could do that if you didn't have hands and you were blind. But it's a talent to make an omelette. Not many people can do it. So, that's good. Nice. Oh, the next one is a... What's been the funniest moment of the season so far on and off the field? The funniest moment on the field is when uh, we were in a very tight situation in the game and there was no trust between a batsman that I could get back to the non-strikers in. It was quite funny because I'm actually quite fast, so I would have made it back. But um, that was quite funny. <laughs> and then off the field, I think every single time someone has a birthday, I've seen people put other things into the cake and onto people's bodies and into their, <laughs> into their pockets and their hard onions and they put it in their ear. So I've got a surprise waiting for the guys when it's my birthday. Mm. I want to see how many guys touch me on my birthday. <laughs> but we'll see how that goes. On that one, on the, on the field, I think you were confident to get back. I think I was not sure about myself if would I would get back on the strike, actually. So I you thought I would dead. not. You mm. would have been the easy. I would have sacrificed. I would have taken the ball out for you. You know when you get given, <laughs> run in front of it, get hit, ah, out, ah, sorry guys, ah, for the team. So the last question for one bowler and batter you hate coming up against in the IPL. There's one guy that I've never gotten out and that's AB. Mm -hmm. I mean, it really frustrates me that I can't get him out. He's 
in, your, in a lot of guys say that, just because he can do what he does. Um, so I don't really enjoy coming up against him, and he's my friend. Mm -hmm. um, so it, it really hurts mm. when he hurts me. <laughs> and yeah. that, ladies and gentlemen, is our interview with Jaju. Pack up. Pack up. <laughs>